What's up everybody, it's Jester here, coming at you from Team 2 Gaming, bringing you some video editing clips. I got the Elgato Stream Deck recently and have been pulling videos, trying to make them pop up in my stream, but there's not a lot of green screen uh, media out there for you, so I figured out a way to make it, and I figured I would share it with you. So here we go. I wanted to make this clip right here. You got knocked up! And... As you can see, there's no green screens of them anywhere. So the first thing you want to do is copy the link. We'll go over here to the converter I use. Put it in here. Convert to MP4 and start it. All right, so when that's done, you go ahead and download it right here. And then we're going to do it in PowerDirector 15. So come down here and launch PowerDirector 15. I wish I could cancel that somehow. For some reason they think I need it. Alright, so you can see some of the green screen stuff I've done. So there it is. And it's three seconds. Out, oh, it's about two seconds long, so it's not going to be bad at all. So we're going to drag it down here. I'm going to say yes to this because that's the ratio thing. And we're going to right click it and go to edit video image. And we're going to go down to edit and color director. Now, I didn't own color director 5, so I downloaded and um, initiated the free evaluation, the, the 30 days free. So we'll go try it now. And it's actually pretty cool. Um, there's some tedious work. The longer the clip, the more the work. So what I want to do is try to turn the brightness up. The contrast down, was it down? And exposure. Trying to get it right. All right. So now what we want to do is click right here to motion tracking mask. And we're going to try to fill him up. Well, this thing does not always work with you very good. Sometimes you'll see how it does little, 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 then jumps. And his hat, I think, is going to be too hard again. So we just want to erase the extra part. And now, I don't think that's his part of his hat. Oh, I thought I clicked back to brush. All right, so that's pretty close. His neck. Not Frankenstein, but it sure does. All right, so that's right there. That's that's pretty good right there. So we're going to come down here to start motion tracking. So it's going to go through, and it's going to motion tracking. But you see it's missing some places, especially his necklace messes with it. So I'm going to show you what you got to do. Now, this is about a two-second video, but this is what you're going to have to do. You're going to go frame by frame. And then whenever you see something bad, you're going to fill it in or erase it. Filling it in or erasing it. Frame. Filling it in. <clears throat> All right, so we got it finished, and if we play it through, you'll see it stays. It stays pretty good. So what we're going to do? We're not going to save it. We're not going to do anything here, except for reverse mask it. We're going to come down to color replacement, and we're going to replace this color. with green I think oh we're going to replace I'm sorry forgive me we're going to replace black with green 
and we're going to turn the tolerance up. All right, so now we're good. We're going to hit back. So now, when we play it, the fuck out, man. so now we're done, right? So now we're done. So now we're going to produce it. And we're going to call this, let's call it Chris T. But let's save it on the desktop. It actually looks like Christ. So let's just call it Tucker. So now we're going to produce it. Done. Right? No, thank you. Hey guys, I'm going to voice over this part because this video played for a minute and a half straight and I figured it was a little profane. So I figured I would cut that out and just do a voice over here and try to keep you up with what I'm doing. All right, so I'm pulling OBS over so I can show you how to set it up in as, as a uh, an item. So you go up to the plus symbol, up to media source. I'm going to name it CT here. So CT, hit OK. Go ahead and select loop. That way it keeps playing and you can see where it's at. Select your image. All right, so when you do this, see the green? Remember the green we put in there? So now we're going to go to filters, and we're going to remove the green. And all that's going to be left is him. So I guess you can't see it here, but I went to scene, or I went to properties, scene, or I'm sorry. Filters, chroma key, and remove the green. So then come down here to add it as to play CT. I did like control zero and to hide it, I did control zero. So anytime you hit control zero, he was going to pop up, play his line and go away. So the only thing about that is, as I think I bring it back over right here, is the eyeball. So when the eyeball is displayed, take it off loop now so it stops. So when the eyeball is displayed, he comes up. So when you click the eyeball, or after the stream deck, he's going to play. Now what the, the bad stream thing deck. is, you're going to hit it again, and it's going to turn the eyeball off. So then it's ready to play again. So it's click to play, click to close, click to play. Alright, so now I've already got it set up on my Elgato stream deck. Right here. So to do that, let's just show you how we do it. So we're going to go system hotkey, we're going to call it T, and we're going to do control zero. You can come here, create new icon, which now I already had one, so set from file, it's in downloads, yeah, so right there is my Tucker, so boom, done. Go ahead and trash it, because I've already got it, and that's how you do it, boys and girls, so now when you press it, um, It'll come up and it'll show you your. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, if you could leave me a like, a comment, and subscribe, I uh, appreciate it a lot. And if there's anybody you would like or any other video clip you'd like to see me do, you can see I've got Travolta, I've got some Mortal Kombat's, Help I Fall and I Can't Get Up, and uh, the America sign. Uh, be sure to leave it in the comments below and I'll try my best to uh, to knock it out. And I will upload that video for download onto my YouTube. So thanks a lot, guys, and we'll see you next time.